want me to shut the lights off? Yeah. No, this one we don't want lights off for. Uh, anyway, for starters here we have uh, potassium iodide and liquid dish soap, and I've added both of the uh, that into the graduated cylinder here, mm. the large graduated cylinder. And you may want to stand back a little more. Let's say. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Sister, just sweet. Are you sure? Good camera. And two, I have here 200 milliliters of hydrogen peroxide that Damn. I need to, to add. Ew. Oh, wow. oh, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. No. Overflow. Why is it steaming? The steam, the te steam is coming from the fact that this is an exothermic reaction, which means that it gives off, it gives off heat. Exothermic reaction, so it gives off heat. The hydrogen peroxide, though, all I did was force it to decompose. You may recall uh, earlier we did a reaction where I used potassium, or excuse me, manganese dioxide. Use manganese dioxide to decompose the hydrogen peroxide. That's the one I did up here uh, that took off when we did the decomposition reaction. Uh, here I have simply decomposed hydrogen peroxide with a different chemical, and the soap then is what makes this, of course, foamy. Uh, mm, but this demonstration foamy. is frequently called it's old dripping. foamy. It's or, uh, let's add this one down there to catch it then. 